Hola. Oh, that's right. Hola. For I am the one, the only. Io del hobo, el vagabundo. Tres. Si, si, si. You know there's a reason why I'm wearing my Southern Pro Lucha Libre shirt. And of course, I have a nice frosty Modelo. Muy bien. That's because, as you saw in the thumbnail, it's Triple Mania time. Oh, the most glorious time of the year. Yes. And you know what that means? Not only will El Hobo El Vagabundo 25 give you his predictions, but also Io Del Hobo El Vagabundo Dos is going to host a watch party. Yes, I do have to speak with Senior Hobo Tom. I have to move stuff around in this house. This office is. Uh, it's nice, but to have a proper watch party with a whole taco buffet. Yes, that is something that is necessary. Oh, wait! I almost forgot something. Hit my music. Vamos a tequila, señorita bonita. I really need it now. Oh, and also, a very special thank you goes out. Kate! You know what? Kate is a good person. She has put up with Sonny Bimbo. Probably more so than most people could or would want to. Therefore, Kate always wins twice with that six count.
Yes, so let's get this prediction show. My ultimo guesses. Moving. Um, so the Triple Mania card. Unfortunately, I had to go work. And I could not invite mi amigo El Sicario here to do dual predictions. They would be better. Because you know what? You know what's... Better than doing dual predictions. Having a friend do dual predictions while imbibing on the especial cerveza of Modera. C, C, C. Now, let us get to the predictions. So, probably in the opening match, and I have no idea what the pre-show is going to be. I don't even know if there's going to be pre-show. I don't even know what the time is. I think it's on the one website they say 9 p.m. Hmm. The main site it says 8 p.m. But wait, if it's... That would make, wait, that would make sense. 8 p.m. Mexico time would be 9 p.m. Lord of the time. Maybe that does make sense now. Let's see. Let's see here. Um, the opening match. And also my stone cold lock. Going to have Pagano, E. Chessman, E. Murder Clown. Taking on Puma King, Adrian Adonis. I don't know. Who is that guy? Should I, let me go take a look. So I actually made the card. I should really know this stuff. I should be a much better host than I probably am. Too bad Senior Hobo Tom did this so long ago. How should I just might as well read it off of this? No. That would be cheating. Only if necessario. Oh, see. It's Team Triple A. No, not that button. Let's see, let's go back. Yes, it's Team Triple A. Which consists of Pagano, Chessman, E. Murder Clown, are taking on La Empresa, the Rudos, and Puma King, Sam Adonis, and DMT Azul. Wait a second. Is this the son of Blue Demon Jr.? I do not know. But again, this is my stone cold lock. And then we have, for the three-way tag team belts, for the triple A world tag, the triple A world tag team champions. We have Los Lucha Brothers of Felix, Ray Phoenix and E. Pentagon Jr. The champions taking on Hinitis del Yare which is the Laredo Kid, and Hijo del Vikingo, and Black Taurus, and to be announced, I say, we're going to have a little more crossover, Crazy Steve shows up, but you know what, Los Lucha Brothers, oh, oh, you know what? 
Hijo del Vikingo y Laredo Kid. They are going to win. X there. Only because I think the Lucha Brothers are going to be doing a lot in IAW. And then we have the Serpent. Oh. I forget. Maybe. So we'll say Drago versus Mamba versus Mr. Iguana taking on hmm, one other person in the Copa Bradai match. See. So I say, hmm, who's that mystery person going to be? Dragon Azteca Jr. C, C, C. But you know who's going to win that? Oh. oh, that is tough now. Mr. Iguana. C, C, C. Then we're going to have the Marvel Lucha Libre Edition Exhibition. Match the Exhibition. We're going to have the Marvel Heroes versus the Marvel Rudos. Yes, the Marvel Technical versus the Marvel Rudos. The crowd must be happy about this. Therefore, the Marvel Technicos are going to win. Honestly, I'll probably be making more tacos for myself, eating some burritos, you having tortilla chips with some salsa verde, so, and drinking, so I'll probably take a nap. And then, oh, in the Cabela's Emascaris match. Oh, not good. Yes, and for those of you who don't know what Lucha de las Puertas, that is a, again, Mascaris v. Cabela's match. I think that's the right word I'm looking for. It's going to be Psycho Clown. Member of Los Psycho Circus, along with Monster Clown and Murder Clown. There's a lot of clowns. Picking on Rey Escorpion. Hmm. Psycho Clown must retain his mascaras. Who cares about Rey, Escipio, Rey Escorpio's hair? He gets a free haircut. Psycho Clown, he's victorious, he keeps his mask. And gets to shave the head of Rey Scipio. Both men win. Rey Escorpion gets a free haircut. Psycho Clown gets to keep his mask. C, C, C. Then, oh, this should be interesting. La Mujeres. A uh, cha champion v. champion match. The AAA Rey de Arenas and Impact Knockouts Championship. This is going to be odd. Fabi Apache has never been here in the States before. Diana Parazzo is probably never going back to Mexico. Oh, you know what that means. The worst dastardly finish of them all. We have a filth, a dusty finish, baby. Nobody wins. What is that voice in my head? That, oh, makes me think of Dusty finishes. Oh, terrible. That horrid, uncivilized accent. But yeah, you know what? In this match, nobody wins. Something screwy is going to happen, and this is a bonus. But yes, it's going to be a no contest somehow. 
People are going to boo. And who knows? Ooh, you know what they could do? They really wanted to make this interesting. Bring back Tessa Blanchard. Have her interfere and cost both people this match. And have her steal both belts. Oh, wow. I did not realize that. And then, let's see here. Yeah, so that was going to be my mashup of the night anyway. So then in the main event of the evening for the Triple A Mega Champion, we have the holder of the belt, the champion, Kenny Omega, taking on Andrade Cien El Idolo Almas, or, because that's copyrighted, can't say that anymore. It's Andrade El Idolo of Los Ingobernoles de Japan. C, C, C. Ooh, to make this fun and interesting, Kenny doesn't necessarily need all that gold. He might take things a little slower. Andrade El Idolo of Los Ingobernoles de Japan. He's going to be the new Triple A Mega Champion. C. And for that, that's my predictions. My por favor guess. C. Um, what else? Oh, yeah, so come watch, come join me. Hijo del Hobo El Vagabundo Dos Saturday night. Um, yeah, I guess 9 o'clock. Because Mexico would be Central Time. Because in Mexico, I guess they would be on Central Time. Where was I watching? Where was... Oh, that was Brazil. That's a whole different place. But in Mexico, they're on Central Time. Again, I'd like to thank... Send my gracias out to all those that watch. Again, please watch, share, comment, subscribe. Uh, comidas, pollo y cerveza. Bien, bien, bien.